Good morning children. Let us begin with the 23rd chapter that is punctuation. Now, punctuation marks help us understand the meaning of sentences and write correctly. So, this is the definition of punctuation. Punctuation marks help us understand the meaning of sentences and write correctly. Now, these are different conditions. Capital letter. When do we use capital letter? We use the capital letter when we bring a new sentence. For example, Charlie is playing cricket. We also use capital letters when we write proper nouns like I have visited New Delhi. It's the name of a place. So New Delhi, Kolkata and Mumbai here. The initials are in capital. Comma. We use a comma between two similar words or ideas example there is a notebook comma a pencil comma an eraser and a pen on your table so we have put comma between notebook and a pencil eraser and a pencil and the last sentence and the last word we have connected with and rohan woke up comma, brushed his teeth, ate breakfast, wore his uniform and went to class. It's, it's an idea of words which are similar. What did, these are series of action like Rohit, Rohin woke up, comma, brushed his teeth, comma, ate breakfast, comma, wore his uniform and went to class. We also use a comma to separate many adjectives used to describe the same noun like the bright comma the red color of the house caught our eyes. Okay, bright red. Okay, these two are adjectives and we have separated it by putting a comma. But the both the uh, both the adjectives are for the word which is house. Here the bright red Everything we are talking about the color of the house. Question mark. When do we use a question mark? We use a question mark at the end of a question. Example, is Maya at home? We are asking something. Whenever we are asking that question sentences are known as interrogative sentences which we have studied and the ending or the question mark we put it towards the end. Exclamation mark. We put an exclamation mark. This is the exclamation mark. At the end of a sentence that shows strong feelings after an interjection. What a tasty dish it is. Ouch, I hurt my foot. Okay. So these all you have to write in your copy. Starting from punctuation, capital letter, comma with example. One, two. Comma, we have to write in our copy along with examples. Question marks, you have to write in your copy with example and exclamation also with examples. Right? Thank you.